Hi friends, today we are going to see demo on Snowflake admin stories on replication. This demo will cover how we can enable replication for the account. If you have not seen my recent blog, then I would recommend you to please have a look at my blog to get the context clear before looking at the demo because without the theory, without the basic concept, uh, this demo will not able to help you much. So I would request you to please go, go and read my blog so that you have the basic understanding of replication and how it works. And then if you come to this uh, video, then you will have a better understanding. If you like my blog and demo, please like and subscribe to my channel and medium blog. Let's start with the demo. So as you can see in this uh, picture, uh, you can see that I have a three different uh, account in my organization. My primary account is in Europe West uh, AWS, which is my service provider. My secondary account is in West Europe Azure, which is my uh, different uh, service provider. And my secondary two account is in US East GCP. So basically you can see that within an organization, I have three different account and three different account are on three different service provider and their respective different regions. So we, we are going to see how we can enable the application from my primary account to my second both the secondary account so let's start with demo so before we start with the demo uh, i would like to showcase you the same thing that uh, this is my primary account and you can see that my primary account has is in europe west to aws similarly uh, my uh, secondary account first is in west europe azure and my Second secondary account is in US East for GCP, right? So this is my three different account in a single organization. And now I'm going to show you how to enable the replication. So let's start that to start with, uh, we have to uh, use the org admin role. Uh, without org admin role, you will not able to uh, enable the replication. So to see what all uh, organization uh, account you have in an organization, you can use the so organization account. So basically when you do so organization account, you will list down all the account in your organization. And basically people don't have this access, only the organization admin or the account admin in your, or the admin people in your organization might have access to this org admin role. But basically to uh, let you understand how the replication works is basically the org admin uh, person or the group of the person who is responsible to do the organization uh, level activities, they will see, they, they will use this show org organization account which will list down all the account in your organization. So here, if you can see, this is my primary account. This is my secondary one account. And this is my secondary two account. So basically these are the three different account in a single organization. And for all the three different uh, organization, you can see that my addition is business critical because I am going to use the account replication and account replication only works for business critical addition or above. So, Let's start with uh, how we can enable. So basically to enable the replication, it's same. You have to use a system global account set parameter and you have to just use the enable account database replication too. So basically you have to mention your secondary one and secondary two account to enable the replication because your primary account is there already. You want to enable the replication for your two different secondary account. So always mention the account locator for your secondary or the target uh, account basically it can be one it can be two or it can be multiple so basically i'm going to just execute this two command but to execute this two command you have to use a role account admin so now i have you will get similar message like success which means your uh, uh, replication initial setup has been done and now your both secondary one and secondary two is ready for replication so here you can see that everything is set up and these are the detail of your replication account. So this is the very initial setup, uh, step number one. We'll see another details on the other demo. Hope you like the demo. Thanks.